of health. A beloved tradition is celebrating its 40th anniversary this year. Yes, the Queen Liliuokalani Keiki Hula competition kicks off tomorrow night with solo performances for Master and Miss Keiki Hula. Mileka Lincoln reports. 16 young ladies and 9 young men will be competing tomorrow night for recognition as the best Keiki Hula dancer. The competition is open to children between the ages of 5 to 12. And over the years, dancers from all across the spectrum have been awarded. But one O'ahu Halau has an extra special connection to the titles. Before she became Miss Aloha Hula 2015, Jasmine Kalehiva Dama was Miss Kiki Hula 2001. For me, I just really wanted to show everybody how much I loved Hula. And when I got out on that stage and I danced my Nani Lava E, it was just such a magical moment for me at only nine years old. And the fact that I, I took the title home was like a blessing in itself. And I still kind of hold that dear to my heart. Only five other dancers in the 40 year history of the competition have won both coveted titles. It's the ultimate goal for little girls who grow up dancing hula. For me, I would love to encourage them to give your all if that's something that you really want. Because at a young age, I knew that that was what I wanted in my future. And the fact that it is now, <laughs> you know, come true, it's, it's such a blessing in its own. 23-year-old Dunlap has been dancing for Hula Halau Okamwela for the past two decades. She was six when she competed in her first Keiki Hula under the direction of Kumukawi Onaleni Kamana'o. I was honored to win the title of the first Master Keiki Hula. Um, and ever since that, um, I never missed a Keiki Hula. Thumb down, four fingers up. Kamana'o was just five when he earned the distinction in 1983. 32 years later, he's helped guide nine other keiki to win soloist recognition. I think hula will live on through our, our kids, and so it's very special um, that they start at a young age. Um, I love my keikis. Marissa Madrano won in 2007. She says watching her little hula sisters perform is inspiring, and she looks forward to sharing the stage with them someday in Hilo. Seeing the bar um, get raised every single year is amazing because that just means that the culture is still flourishing and then when they become adults and they dance in Mary Monarch and stuff, it makes that bar even higher. So I think that's amazing. 22 halau from all over the state, even Japan, will be performing at the 40th annual Queen Liliu Okaleni Keiki Hula competition, which airs on K5 August 3rd through the 5th. Mila Lincoln, Hawaii News Now.